It's no secret that this entire USMLE journey can cost thousands of dollars. So I'm going to share with you some free resources that can not only save you some money, but also increase your score. So the first free resource that we can use for all USMLE step exams, and yes, I mean USMLE step one, USMLE step two CK, and the USMLE step three, is Anki. So if you want to implement spaced repetition into your studying, then this is the go-to resource. Um, it's important that you know that it's not free if you use like the Apple Store, but it is free on Android devices or non-Apple devices. You can use Anki to create your own decks for anything that you've studied, whether it's from Sketchy or Boards and Beyond, or you can even access pre-made decks that you can study from. The next free USMLE resource is Online Meded. So with Online Meded, you can access a lot of free videos that are perfect for the USMLE Step 2 CK and the USMLE Step 3. The only downside of the online meted free version is that you do have to sit through a couple of ads as you watch the videos and I believe that your ability to like speed up the videos may not be there or may be a bit limited but otherwise like I said really really high yield content that is perfect for the USMLE Step 2 and the USMLE Step 3. And honestly, if you want to, you could combine these two free resources, like watch the free online meded videos and then make flashcards or Anki decks for free using the Anki app. That method would be perfect for audiovisual learners that also want to incorporate some space repetition into their studying routine. The next and probably the most underrated free resource is... Reddit. So Reddit can be an amazing resource. So you've probably seen services where they charge IMGs thousands of dollars to provide one-on-one -on -one services or guidance through the USMLE process or the US residency application process. However, Reddit really has a friendly community where you can just ask questions and people will answer you and reach out to you. Not only that, but you can get up-to-date information about new trends or changes with the USMLE exams and if you're doing questions and you don't understand you can put a question out there and there will be many people that will be willing to help you. So instead of spending hundreds and thousands of dollars on tutoring it's best to check out reddit and see what's there and what other cheaper options would be there or even free options as well. But that is definitely the best place for free advice. Now let's get into free USMLE practice tests. So in this month of May, AMBOSS had a self-assessment week for the USMLE Step 2 CK. So basically you had the option to sign up for that free self-assessment and they would give you your score, your three-digit score, in a couple of weeks. And it was completely free. All you had to do was to just sign up. So I recommend that anyone who has not tried AMBOSS, you can go ahead and sign up for it. They have a free five-day trial. And when you sign up for it, you'll get updates afterwards if you opt into their newsletter or their updates. And that's how you can find out about free self-assessment weeks because they do have free self-assessment weeks for USMLE Step 2 CK and the USMLE Step 1 every now and then. And the next free USMLE practice test resource is USMLE RX. So USMLE RX has a pretty huge question bank for the USMLE Step 1 and Step 2 CK that you have to pay for. However, this week is the first time ever that they will have a free USMLE Step 1 self-assessment week. So if you have not done the USMLE Step 1 as yet, I highly, highly recommend that you go on the USMLE RX website, sign up for that completely free self-assessment, 
and do it so that you can have more practice, more exposure to questions, and they'll also provide you with a three-digit score. For this self-assessment, you'll have four 40 question exam modules, and they're also offering 40% off for anyone who does the USMLE self-assessment exam during the week of May 17th to May 24th. So you will get that 40% off for any new subscriptions if you need an extension on an existing subscription or if you need any upgrades. So you will get 40% off by just doing a completely free USMLE Step 1 self-assessment. If you know about any other free USMLE resources, please leave them in the comment section below so that we can help out the MD Powerhouse community. As always, if you enjoyed this video, power up the like button, hit subscribe and that notification bell so that you never ever miss another video like this.